Hey guys, it's Rob here, and welcome back to the Robotron Show, where we take the gaming news format that channels like Spawn with our Arlo do, add a dash of animation, and some cool editing on top to bring you your gaming news, leaks, and rumors in a fresh new way. If you're new here and want to be kept up on everything gaming, make sure you subscribe to the channel and leave a like if you enjoy the video and dislike if not. So let me ask you guys a question. If you could have any character from Nintendo to have their own animated series, what would it be? Personally, I would love to see a Legend of Zelda series. I think there is a lot of potential. Not only that, but a Metroid Prime series as well. I think Metroid Prime has a ton just a ton of potential for a movie or a TV series. And weirdly enough, I think Star Fox could really work as well. The reason why I bring this up is that Nintendo is going to be making more of these movies and TV shows on their Nintendo IPs because they just started Nintendo Studios. So we're going to be talking about that and we're going to be talking about the Super Mario animated movie that they just showed with the new poster and a pretty good look at Mario. Now it's only the back of Mario unfortunately so we don't know if the front of Mario is going to look good but I suppose you could say that it will probably look fantastic. I mean, it's Mario. How can they screw that up? I mean, the 1993 movie, they screwed that up, but I think they screwed it up in like a good way. It's so bad, it's good. I, I love the 1993 Mario movie, but anyways. So according to VGC, a new company named Nintendo Studios has been spotted in the copyright listing for the upcoming Super Mario animated movie. Now, one thing you have to keep in mind that they say on the VGC article is that this listing was already in the United States Copyright Office website for some time, so it's already been there for a lot of time, someone just noticed it just now. And that someone was a Twitter user by the name of Michael O2K. Now this paragraph that VGC has has me a little bit concerned, and this is what it says. The listing shows copyright records for the upcoming Mario movie and indicate that the film's copyright are registered to Nintendo of America, Nintendo CO Ltd, Illumination Entertainment, and Universal Pictures. Now, I hope someone can correct me in the comment section if I'm wrong, but does this mean that Nintendo is going full in on Illumination and not going to other companies for their other IPs and stuff? I hope not because I would like a variety of Nintendo things. And by Nintendo things I mean Nintendo movies and TV shows because I just don't want one company doing Nintendo IPs for their movies and TV shows. I think that would be boring. I think the fantastic thing about movies and anime and TV shows and cartoons is that there are so many styles that you can do and so many animations and so many varieties that you can go through for these different IPs that you can do a lot of cool things. I mean you saw this with the Star Wars anime that they showed off in different various styles and that's just for anime and then there's the Star Wars Clone Wars and all of these kind of things and it's just Star Wars and that's just for Star Wars imagine if they did that but for different IPs there are so many routes you can go I mean look what Illumination did with Mario already so far it's looking fantastic if you look at the poster with Toad and Mario and just the Mushroom Kingdom and just the feeling when you look at this poster you feel like yes this is Mario this is exactly what we had in our mind or at least that's what I had in my mind. Tell me in the comment section if you don't like this poster because that's something that I think could happen. Some people could not like this poster. But I hope that this doesn't mean that they're just going in on Illumination and they'll ask other studios and other places to do different animations for different Nintendo IPs. I mean, could you imagine if they asked, say, Studio Trigger to do a... Legend of Zelda series or a Metroid series. I mean, if you watch Cyberpunk Edgerunners, you know that was fantastic. And I think they do great with a Zelda series or a Metroid series or even a Star Fox series would be really cool as well. I mean, this has me really excited because if you guys didn't know, when I started this channel, I started at doing movie reviews. If you go back to my older reviews, there are a ton of movie reviews and I just love movies. I go to the movie theater once or twice a week. If Nintendo can essentially become the Marvel Studios of Nintendo, Nintendo, then that would be fantastic. Think of all the IPs that we can get from Mario to Zelda to Metroid to Star Fox to Kirby to just so many great IPs and even smaller IPs, maybe even I don't know, Ice Climbers. I mean, Ice Climbers show would be very interesting as well. I mean, could you imagine if they eventually built up to, say, a Super Smash Bros. movie? That would be fantastic as well. That would be really, really cool. And then you can even have, like, Cloud in there or Sora in there. There is so much you could do with this that it's getting me really excited at all the possibilities. 
Now, if you guys haven't heard yet, there's going to be a Mario trailer dropping on October 6th, and it's going to be in a Nintendo Direct. So this is a little weird, because usually when you think of Nintendo Directs, you think of games, right? You want to see games in a Nintendo Direct, but this time it's just going to be a movie. Now, I do wonder if they're going to show anything else in this, because it's a Nintendo Direct. You would think that they would be showing something more than just the trailer, because if it was just the trailer, I don't think they would put it in a Nintendo Direct, so I don't know what else they could show. I don't know if they're going to show maybe a new Mario game, or maybe, um, I don't know. Yeah, a new Mario game. I mean, that's all I can think of. And if they do show a new Mario game, I wonder, like, what kind of Mario game is it going to be? Is it going to be a 2D game or a 3D game? Is it going to be Mario Odyssey 2? I mean, who knows? I do think that there's a very low chance of that happening. I honestly don't think it's going to happen at all, but if it does happen, I wouldn't be too surprised because it's a Nintendo Direct, and usually they save those Nintendo Directs for very big moments, and I guess you could say that the Mario movie is a big moment. I just think if this movie can hit it off, I would be extremely happy because I am a huge movie and TV fan. I watch all of the things. Well, not all of them. I skipped She-Hulk because, uh, honestly, the trailer just didn't look good, and, well... You see how that turned out now, and I was pretty much right. I saved myself $10 on Disney+. Plus. But essentially, I watch a lot of those shows, and I really enjoy doing that, and I would love to cover them on this channel if they're Nintendo-related. Again, if you want to check out any of those movie reviews, I did a lot of movie reviews. I think I did about 200 movie videos before I even started gaming stuff. It's in the back catalog of this channel. You can go all the way back, and you can see all of the movies that I reviewed. I think the last one I reviewed was The Joker. But overall, this is fantastic. Now, tomorrow, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a complete breakdown of this poster and try to figure out all the bits and pieces of that poster in like what kind of homages to the Mario games that are in there. Like I first noticed the POW barrel right there, which is kind of weird because usually the POW is a block, not a barrel. So that's kind of interesting also see the notes in the corner as well under the antique shop so that's pretty interesting that they're calling it antique bees you could say that is part of either just the regular notes from the Mario games or it could be a Easter egg for Mario paint as well which would be really cool if we can get another Mario paint Mario paint was pretty good on the SNES but anyways I'm really excited for this it looks fantastic so far I'm hoping that trailer on the 6th is really great I guess we're gonna have to wait and see but for now tell me your thoughts in the comment section below do you think this looks fantastic do you think it looks like utter garbage do you think it's just okay or are you just kind of on the fence and waiting to see the front of mario because we know how the 1993 movie turned out and um well it's a very weird bad good movie it it'll make more sense once i do my review on that but yeah tell me your thoughts in the comment section below and i will see you guys in the next video and if not on your way out, make sure you subscribe for more videos and also have that notification bell on. And if you want to support the channel in any other way, there is my Patreon and Twitter account in the pinned comment if you're interested in those. Oh, and also have this donut if you're still sticking around for me rambling. Thanks for watching guys, and remember, stay safe, stay charged, and have a good one.